Hello ladies and gentlemen, I'm Rob and welcome to Epistory Typing Chronicles. Once upon a time. It was the best of times. It was the worst of times. Let's just be cliche. There was a girl. And she rode upon the back of a great fox. Slightly less cliche. They had always been lost. Mm -hmm. Until a path appeared. And so she followed. Oh. Oh, that's peculiar. Was the path leading her? Or was she leading it? She didn't know. It was just there. Okay. Well, it's not quite wasp control. All of a sudden, but she knew where she no was. She was home. The woods had sheltered her as a child. Oh, she was home. Because home is where you put your hands to type in typist language. The path was blocked before her. Path okay. stretched deeper into the forest. Animals. Maybe animals. She remembered animals frolicking in the glades. She remembered planting flowers. Each word typed gives inspiration points. Remember to press space to display the words. Ooh, I see a box. Yeah. She remembered discovering precious stones. New upgrade available. What? Up upgrade? There's upgrades? Meh. Ah. She would have to burn the brambles before she could pass through them. Oh. Whoops. She remembered finding magical things in the underbrush. she remembered, the stronger she felt. Dangers awaited beyond the forest, sensing a terrible wrongness. She looked up, and fire fell from the sky. Oh my. I'm on fire. And it covered that area in runestone. Had stones. a star died? Had the moon fallen? She didn't know, but she wasn't home anymore. Chitinous chattering creatures began to appear. This is going to get very hard. <laughs> I can feel it already. The trees began to give way to ash and char. This was where the meteor had struck. The path ended here. Or did it begin?
Cool, good start. She found herself alone, lost in darkness. The meteorite had buried itself deep. Wicked things crept from its dark core. Briar and bramble blocked her path. Ancient paintings covered the walls. games that I'm getting into and playing is, is kind of kind of brainless things, right? It's on my phone, whatever. So. Uh, the so maze really began to crumble brain. before her.
way now. Yeah. Like barbecue. Which way? Which method of spelling barbecue are you going for this time? Cooks tonight. Oh my god! Toy. Uh, toy? Why are you not? What? Oh. Stood the meteor's heart. This word will burn. Try to set insects on fire as soon as possible and get them time to burn. She emerged once more into the light. Though the ground would be forever marked, green shoots of new life surrounded her. Oh, that's lovely. So, having solved that little problem, I think that we'll call it a day here. And that has been Epistory Typing Chronicles. So, if you're 
into a little typing game or trying to get your kids or well, teens or adults to learn how to touch type without actually looking down at the keyboard or minimal looking down at the keyboard. Anyhow, this is uh, definitely a good one to be getting for that if that's what you're looking for. But that is enough for today. I've been Rob and I will see you all in the next episode. Ciao, folks.